Hello, welcome back to Surviving Mars Maximum Difficulty Challenge with Lion's Pride. So, we're going to continue from exactly where we left off in the last episode, sending our explorer down to look for, look at this anomaly for us. We have a dust storm approaching, which means we have to consider the water is going to not be produced from our muck, uh, vaporators. So we kind of have to basically get this guy over here working again at the moment. Which is the main reason I installed it in the first place, because I knew something like this was eventually going to happen. And you can't live without them. Unfortunately, now the other thing is we need the transporter. Because there's no... I don't believe there's any... No, there's no machine part in range, so... Transporter room. Well, no, not room because it's not the Enterprise, but transporter. Could you please collect some machine parts? You know, five will do, five will do. Um, off we come. If you could pop them down right there, much appreciated it will be. So that should link up. Uh, that. Now, it's unfortunate we literally just got this working again and now there's going to be a dust storm because I don't like sending our people out in dust storms to work it out. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. And excuse me. That's what I thought. You keep going that direction, my friend. No, 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 no. Where are you going? Uh, wrong thing. Yeah. Bye. Don't come back. Uh, have you done? you dump them already? You did, and the drones put it back into the depot. Right. They're clever little drones. <coughs> oh, they're doing what they've been programmed to do, but that's not the point. How are we looking over here? 12 souls, that's painful. Uh, eight hours to the dust storm. There's not a lot else I can do, really. I mean... Right, seven, six, five, the four, found. three, up. The anomaly turned out to be one of the most well-preserved asteroid impacts in our area. No geologist could ever put a price on it. Long story short, with the... They, they will have so, I mean, you can pause it if you want to read the whole lot. With the data we gathered from the site, our colleagues on Earth have materials for years of research. Maybe we would finally we would finally find out whether the Martian core was shut down or it died out on its own. And we'd be able to predict the destiny of our homeworld. Well, the, predict the destiny of our homeworld is largely dependent on what we do to combat the mega corporations that are trying to hold on to power. Let, let's say. But uh, I won't go into that right now. We gain 800 million in funding, which is great, and 3,000 research, which is even better. That set us, sent us on quite a few days, and that means we nearly have enough money to outsource. In fact, we could just outsource a load. Hmm. Tempting. Right, two hours. What's also tempting is if we wait for the rocket to get to Earth, And then we outsource the maximum, just in one go. Right, I'm turning that off because... Well, of course I am. We're not having anyone working outside a dome in a dust storm, are you crazy? Now, I hope... Well, I'm not even going to hope they all reallocate themselves, I'm going to reallocate them for them. 
and it'll just give us some extra machine parts. I mean, I know we've already got a fair few, but uh, it's, it'll be nice to have a little stockpile of them for the future. Yeah, that's all the buildings not working. You are producing nothing. Why? I don't... Oh, inactive work shift? No, 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 no. No such thing. Right, so now we should be... Yeah, that's full. That's fine. We're doing great. We are doing brilliantly. For now. I almost don't want to go at too fast speed, just in case we have a leak and we've got to try and plug it really quickly and the higher the speed you're at the less chance there is of that happening coal machines oh what's wrong okay several colonists were injured today the severity of their injury injuries varying in accidents all involving drones because the time frame the accidents happened was rather small, the ensuing quick investigation ensuing quick investigation found software corruption in all of the involved drones. Corruptions our engineers say can only happen if the systems were hacked. Although an obvious act of sabotage, we can't prove who is to blame precisely. What we can do is raise the issue to earthly judicial bodies which will probably hinder all of our rivals, not just the guilty ones, operations for a short while. Well, we can say no one was killed, fortunately, just make sure our drones are better protected from now on. But, and I say this with prejudice of some description, we were attacked in space, uh, which could potentially, I mean, colonists were injured. How many drones are we going to lose? What, what? I don't even know what the ramifications of this are going to be yet. Um, of course, we're going to have to ring the bell on this one and inform the UN. Now, unfortunately, I'm going to go with it. Uh, all rivals lose funding and standing with me. While I'm not actually planning on using the rivals for anything, um, like the whole po point of the playthrough is to try not to interact with the rivals. They're hindering us, but we don't really call on them for trade. I thought about maybe trading with them earlier on, but... If that's if we're gonna die of starvation, we're gonna we're gonna trade. But other than that, we lose four drones. Well, thankfully, all I can say is, uh, uh, no, that's not all I can say. Thankfully, all I can say is we've we we don't seem to have. A huge drone shortage right now, so <sighs> glad it happened now and not at some point where we need the drones badly. Right. Pause. Leak detected. Leak detected here. Right. <sighs> 27.3, that's a fairly big leak. We're going to shut that down. We're still losing minus four per sol. Um, well, that's not going to change with the sun, so we're going to stick in a... Yeah, we're going to stick in another wind turbine. We've got the machine parts for it. It's in the range of a triple electric scrubber. It should be grand. Now, I don't know. Oh, I know exactly why that's not working because the power's being cut. Has it been repaired? I think it has. Right. Back on with you then. Yeah, we've we minus one option. We can't get around that, unfortunately. Demand is 0 0.7, capacity 115, 8 cells worth, that's fine. Again, don't really want to go too fast at this stage. Uh, I kind of want to be saving just in case the proverbial who hits the proverbial spinny thing. 
but that kind of goes against the spirit of things. Right, that's seven we're losing now. I'm not even going to worry about turning this off for the time being. You can just get plugged at the next available convenience of the drones. Problem is, we're still getting seniors, but we're not getting many children. We've got more middle-aged now than we have youth, children, adult, and adults, and youth and children and adults, yeah. That's not great. That's not great. We need more children. That looks like it would have been painful if it hit someone. Sector scanned. Hey, we have new anomalies. I'm bit reluctant to do this, but we'll send you anyway. Go on, off you go, see what's there. Where are you now anyway? Alright, you're actually getting closer to home. I forgot to bring you home. Ooh. It's treacherous weather at the moment. to the barren environs of the red Advanced planet that meets Advanced gravity the maneuvers and domeless farming. An open farm. Right. Plants edible crop across the seeds. Right. Hmm. I like that line there. If the amount of hours spent on Farmville we're spent on actual farming. Imagine what we could achieve. Um, the travel time between asteroids and Mars by 75% reduction. That's great for when we get there. But right now we are so concerned about just having colonists. I mean, we've only got one child. Zero youth, seven adults, 11 middle-aged and three seniors. This is not going well, even though we've got 80, 85 comfort. Which is more than enough to be having loads of children, and yet we're having hardly any children. I don't understand what the problem is. Like, I really don't get it. If anyone has any ideas of what's going, what I'm doing wrong, please let me know in the comments below. Oh, that's great news. Meteor shower. Just what we need. Brilliant. Oh, that's just, 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 just amazing. Thanks, Randy. Randy, the RNG god. What's that noise? Okay, I don't care. Um, this, this could be good, or this could be bad. Please don't hit us. Please don't hit us. Please don't hit us. Oh, leak. A leak that's actually shut down our life support. That's not good. That's going to cause sanity problems. Oh, poo. Boo, 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 boo. Right, maybe it wasn't down for long enough. No, it would have been. It would have been down for long enough. Not much we can do about it, really. I hate dust bombs. It's one of the natural disasters that really... Um, well, I hate... Dust storms and meteorites are the two, two, two things I really hate right now. When are you going to be back at Earth? You're still not back yet. Sector That's scanned. Really annoying. Renegade stole fuel. Thanks, guys. Yeah, you're really helping us. I don't know what your cause is on Mars, but you're um, you're endangering funding everybody received. here. Okay, there's our funding. Good. You're endangering everybody here. I hope you're happy about it. That. Wow. 
603 left. Do I want to bring anything home with me? Do I hell? You just get back here now. Uh, I am not looking forward to... I'm looking forward to the end of the dust storm. I am not looking forward to the meteorite storm. Okay, dust storm finished. That's good, brilliant news. Ah, boy, that's not good news. The RC command has been struck. Um, can you repair your own RC commander? You can. Great, good news. Uh, transport, where are you? Right, uh, we are running low on medals. There's 88 medals in this area. I know there's a dust, there's a meteorite shower approaching. I don't know where it's going to hit. We've got five hours until we find out. So, of course, I'm going to do this clever thing and send you on a mission. Well, I could do the flow camera, but I'd actually rather do this. I'm cringing right now. I don't want to even know where this is going to hit. Please don't be on us. Please don't be on us. Where is it? Okay, it's going on the peninsula down here. That's the best news I've heard all day. Right. Yeah, the problem with having the, um... Meteor incoming. What? Okay, yeah, that, that... <gasps> Shock horror, that sucks. Really bad. Please don't do that again. Well, actually, I don't care if you do that again. Let's not fake this. But, oh no, shock horror, really bad. <laughs> uh... Yeah, so... This should be picking up... Medals, it is, it is, it is. How many of you Meteor got? incoming. Okay, that's fine. Would it be too much to ask for a bit of research at this point? I don't care if you don't. Like, as long as you're not hitting me. Scanned. I really don't care. And we have an anomaly, right? Where is our explorer? Dora the explorer, you're right there. Okay, off you go. Get us some new technologies. Well, that's good news if ever I heard it. Oh, whoa, 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 what was that? Looks like a twister died. As long as it died. Anyway, that's saying it can... Ah, oh, it's just gone over its maintenance. And we don't need it on anymore. That would be actually a shame to waste it being on, but if I don't turn it off, I'll forget it's on, and then it'll use another one, and I'll say the same thing again. But one thing I can do now is go, oh dear, why don't we have enough workers? That's because they're all getting old and frail, and we've got lots less people than we have newborn. We have, we have zero children. Guys, what is actually wrong with you? I know lots of sexy people died, but still, please, would you just have children? Otherwise, we're not going to have any more children. It'll be the end of the game. Oh boy, this could this is going really badly. I, I don't understand why they're not having children. They should be having children. Well there's some children. Two of them. Thank you. Thank you, Randy. Or colonists. 
But it's it's randy because the game is random number generation. But yeah, thank you, colonists, for having children. You are. There's more to the barren environs. Of Advanced the rocketry, planet. low G tunnel supports. Reduce the risk of cave-ins. Right, okay. And advanced rocketry. Allows the construction of rockets on Mars. Rockets carry 10 more colonists. <laughs> yeah, we don't need that. Uh, but allows the construction of rockets is good. We do need that because one of ours got destroyed in a test. Wow, they're chewing into that metal pile really quickly. Where are they all going with it? Oh, I lost them. They chewed through the whole pile. Must have been putting it in another... Oh wow, we actually got some science out of this. That's cool. It's still going on for another soul and it's gone that far around the clock. Yeah, we could have problems if, if it carries on going around the clock. Thanks for letting us know about the anomaly and we're just going to queue up a few choice research uh, scans. In fact, we're going to cancel them ones. We're just going to jump straight into them ones. Our towers hopefully are still there and we'll get some results fairly quickly. Right, they're coming back to Mars, and we're mining metals to put on the defense back home. Okay, I'm kind of happy-ish. We've still we got back up to 23, but we need to get more colonists. We need we need all eight of them them resident blocks filled. If we're to have even a hope of surviving, we need to get a bit more, 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 more of everything. Um, thankfully. Our colonists are going to live a bit longer with the STEM reconstruction project. Sector I don't scan. know if that means they also have babies for longer. It'd be nice if they do. Why are you not working? Uh, yeah, someone's died, I guess, or become old or something. Yeah, someone else has reached senior age. You know something? It's fine. I don't need that shift. We've got loads and loads. In fact, I'm thinking I might even turn up another shift at this rate. And we could have, in fact, I'm going to do that. We're going to turn off another shift and we're going to stick another shift on in the middle of the day here. Wow, they took another job. So there must have been another job that needed doing. Yeah, no, lots of people are getting old. But what can I say? We've been stuck at 22, 23 colonists sector for a long scan. time now. Okay, another sector scan. We have an anomaly in it that's good that's very good it's more new technologies but you know something's better than nothing right explorer you go have a look oops yeah three hours left on the meteorite storm and we're done that's good news there is peace again in the pride -dom. The pride -dom? The kingdom? The pride -dom? The king pride -dom? Anyway. Lion's Sector pride has down. found peace for a little time. And we're about to also find a longer lifespan for our colonists, which... Oh, not a moment too soon. Hopefully that means they can have babies for longer. Come on. Three, two... One. Research complete. Thank the heavens for that. Now, I want to get something tangible. I want to get this. It's 3,000. It's quick. It'll be 10 souls at most. It'll have something we can build and it'll start making something different happen on the map. It'll keep our drones busy. It'll start towards our terraforming process. I just need something, god damn it, because I've been sitting here watching them numbers go up for too long. 
There's New text. more to the barren environs of the red planet than meets the eye. Well, 18,000 for deep metal extraction. That sucks. That's really expensive. Uh, water conservation system. That's great. It's way too expensive. Uh, what else did we get? <sighs> it doesn't matter. It's all way too expensive right now. Everything up that end of the spectrum is going to be way too expensive for a while. Right. Uh, Explorer Anomaly. Anomaly Explorer, I'd like to introduce the two of you together, please. Sector scanned. Yep, no resources. Good, good, good. We're now down to two souls for that. Uh, Explorer. I'd like you to go and hide yourself there in case of dust bombs, please. Sector scanned. Oh wow, anomaly found. Yeah, I kind of hoped that would be the case. That's a breakthrough. Uh, Explorer, change course. Bearing, um, where are you? Yeah, bearing 3.2, whatever. I don't care, just go and scan the damn thing. Please be a good break breakthrough. Please be a good breakthrough. Please be a good breakthrough. Please be a good breakthrough. Come on. We need a good one. We need a good one. Good one. Sector scanned. Ah, oh, Jesus, they're taking forever. Come on. Come on. Discovered. Service bots? What's this? Non-medical service buildings upgrade service bots. Service buildings no longer require workers and operate one hundred percent performance. <sighs> Really? Really? Ooh, how much does that cost? Wow, only 2,800, eh? <laughs> um, you know something? It's not the best one we could have had, it, by a long shot. I mean, you know, automatic mines would have been good. Um, uh, what else? Um... Soylent Green. Well, we don't really need that on this playthrough. We're not doing too badly for food at the moment. Uh, what else could we have had? There's a lot of things we could have had. Um, some of them better and some of them a lot worse. We've already got a lot of the worst ones. You know what? I'll take it. I will take it. That's absolutely effing brilliant. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Right. Okay. That means that, you know, service buildings, that's like the diner non-medical so the infirmary doesn't count but the diner will have it um the grocer will have it there's like six people we've saved straight away which can go straight into the factories like again it's not the best thing ever because we could if we had the automatic miners all we'd have to do is set up the miner and the power and the drone hub and away it goes so you know okay thanks randy you've given me a bone it's not a bone of contention either it's just a, a bone but it's not the best one we could have had it, it just is what it is um but you know sometimes you can't look a gift horse in the mouth as the man said fuel refinery is not working why storage space is full what storage stored fuel is full why because our fuel storage is full. Okay. Um, you already need to land. You land. That'll help with the situation. In the meantime, we also need to make a new storage for fuel. By the apparently, like I'm actually really surprised. But <laughs> yeah, there we go. Stranger things have happened. Although I'm not sure when, or where, or how. That's got to be the first for one of. It's got to be a first for me. Anyway, the drones just rush in to service the rocket. And... We'll hopefully be sending that packing back to Earth very, very shortly. And ah, 
Ah, well, you know what? This episode's not been too bad. I've got something, finally a breakthrough that I'm kind of happy about. I don't know what it's going to cost in terms of upgrading, but... Right, transport. Uh, we probably need you to go and do some more scavenging. We don't seem to have a lot left. Like, in the, air, in, in the immediate areas, like, we have plenty around. I mean, there's some down this way, I guess. Yeah, do you mind just picking up some of that stuff and bringing it back? Be a darling, would you? Good show. Jolly good show. Ah, right. Sector scanned. Research complete. Way. Okay, service box is next, definitely. Uh, greenhouse Mars, that means we have some... Oh, terraforming. I'd love to do lakes, but we can't. But we can do a gigafactory, GHD factory. Costs, we can afford all of that. Uh, consumption, oh, it uses fuel. Why up did I think it used rock? Why did I think it used rock? I don't know. Um, okay, it does use the, the, the locally extracted carbon. But he uses fuel? Why doesn't it produce power then? Uh, well, look it. We've got power over here. It's a short enough um, cable. It'll give the drone something to do. I'm 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 not happy about it. It's halfway between the fuel and the thing. I didn't actually know it needed fuel. But you know what? Worse things have happened. I don't really I, I need to amplify this and see if it increases the water use. Oh boy. Let's just do it. Or do I not want to do it? I don't know. Do I want to do it or do I not want to do it? I need to look into it. In fact, I'm actually going to look into it before I do it. Whoops. Wrong button. Um, right. These episodes I managed to keep to the half hour. I don't know how, but I do. So we're like 150, 200, 300, 10. Uh, we're not even a halfway through a year yet. But we're getting there slowly. I mean, we've accomplished some things this less this lesson lesson episode. Sorry, this is not a lesson. This is an episode. But still, we've got no children. Um, we've got more middle aged than before, and we've got less adults. Oh, this is not looking good. I really am not. I am not looking forward to where this this series is heading. Ah, anyway. Hopefully my fears are dumbfounded and hopefully we're going to get somewhere. Whether or not we do remains to be seen and hopefully you'll join me to see where it goes. I'd love, I've actually already got my previous difficulty challenge still saved and I'm really good quite far on on this map and I was going to terraform the whole thing but look it was all on Twitch and Twitch doesn't save them and I deleted all of them and long story short i don't have that episode in series anymore and i could carry on with the save file but i don't see the point because you'd all be watching a, a like a halfway through the game file anyway look hopefully we don't have to worry about that hold on what's this oh it's ready to launch right okay it really is ready to launch actually it's proper ready to launch as in full metals and everything Right, we'll send that packing. Um, has that been amplified? It has. 
Uh, right, that's the Eternal Summer. That's oh, that's going to be sitting there forevermore, eternally even. Um, <laughs> yeah, I, I I hope we get over the hump of have, not having enough people because this is ridiculous. I don't understand our, our our comfort in the main dome is 82. It's not the best, but. Uh, hopefully with the service buildings upgrade, we'll have some better outcomes. Right. Speak to you again soon. Ciao for now.